Yeah, just like to say, um, just delighted with the performance. I thought a uh, great way to finish the championship for us. We, um, we, we were really up for a big one here at Eden Park uh, last last game, and and I think it was a, a you know there's still areas to, for improvement, but I just loved the attitude and the and and the strength. The set piece went really well, but. Overall, the, the I guess the commitment to play the way we wanted to play was there. So and it was against a very dis uh, a very physical Australian team. I won't say discipline, but a very physical Australian team, and and we had a little bit to overcome in that first 20 minutes. So really proud of the effort, and uh, it's given ourselves a chance anyway for the championship. Thank you. <coughs> Uh, well, I think you save those com those answers to later in the year. You know, I think right now we can only do what's in front of us, which was to to um, to finish this championship really, really strong, and to show that show ourselves really that the, the gains that we're making we can put out on the park. So, um, and so in, in that sense, uh, we, 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 I'm pleased with that. Uh, probably the first. Uh, 50, 60 odd minutes. Um, keeping them scoreless was was massive. It gave us <coughs> massive confidence, and um, there were some big shots put in there. But at the same time, we um, didn't get out of the the tackle area quick enough, and and that put us under some pressure. But the guys defending hard on our line, the desire was there, the effort was there. So that's always the first thing to look at, and um, the boys really. Showed what it means to play at home um, for our, our last test match here in New Zealand uh, for this year. I don't. I don't know. That he's told me he's been waiting a wee while to start at twelve. He's, he, he's he loves playing for the All Blacks, so he loves whatever jersey we give him. Um, and. But you know, I was delighted with Davy's growth this campaign. But uh, and, I, and I'm delighted with what Geordie gave us today. Oh, I thought he had a phenomenal game. Really, he was very physical. He he um, with the ball, without the ball, he worked hard. He got some kicks in. So you know, he should be very proud of that effort. <coughs> yeah, pretty happy. Well, you, you're trying to learn, aren't you? You know, and it's um, um, and you know, you're always trying to, you're trying to learn before the first game too. And but, you know, the fact is that we've we've come through this championship and um and, and showing some growth in that aspect. And, and it's a losable game when you play Australia at the moment because, you know, we saw last week, you know, how how good and dangerous they can be, and I think we saw spells of that again today. So. You know, we had to be on our game and we had to improve. And I thought we highlighted some areas that we felt we had some edges last week. And, and I think we were a lot more ruthless how we exploited those this week. I've forgotten about the roller coaster, to be honest, Liam. I'm just happy in the moment. You know, we've come into a championship. We've, we've had in our mind probably the hardest draw we could have by having both tests against South Africa and South Africa. Um, we've got one out of two in that space. We've we've um, we've let ourselves down in, in Christchurch and but our response to that's been really positive. So, you know, we look at the last half of the championship and and really pleased with what we need. and all we can do now is deal with what's in front of us right now and look at the gain. So but to be here tonight, you know, when I, I know we've got a bit of a buffer. Whether it's enough, don't know. But, um, um, heck, you know, we're giving ourselves a chance, and that's all we want. And to have that sort of scoreline, if we were offered that before the test, you'd probably take it. Sam, uh, I think three of the five tries by the kind of line-out drive type <coughs> the performance. Um, how pleasing was that from your perspective? And, and how much growth have you made in that area, do you think, this year? Yeah, um... It's always interesting, you know, forward scoring more, more tries. It, it's great the whole crowd was in behind it. Um, they're not easy to score, so to get a couple tonight is uh, is awesome. Um, the boys have been working really hard in that area, um, attacking but also defensively, so really nice to 
see some of the reward for the hard work that's gone in. Um, but yeah, another couple would be nice. Sam, what was your understanding of the try, um, your try, that, and how that played out? What do you mean? I just in terms of the, the process that the referee um, went through in, in terms of the team. Um, I was back half, at halfway, so I don't actually know what he went through, but um, yeah, kind of got caught in a bit of a tricky situation and just had to hold hold on to it and try to find a way to get it down. So well, I don't think they could believe that old gadget arms that could hold on to that ball and the different angles that he had it, and he did. So to be fair to the ref and the TMA, it, it looked a little bit peculiar, didn't it? But um, the big mitt hung on to the ball. I'm going to get up. That's assuming I go to bed first. But I, if I go, if I go to bed first, I'm going to get up. Yeah, there's a bit of work to be done yet, obviously in the, in the final phase of the year. But when you were, particularly in July, I mean, you know, is there some satisfaction? Is there some contentment that you've made, made strides, made progress? Uh, yep, yep. Pleased and. Um, you know, all you can do in the circumstances that you get dealt with is to try to find a way out of it. And, um, and you know, we've I think we've owned very clearly that we put ourselves in a situation. And um, But I, I just really back the the group that we've got to, to get through an issue. And it, it, we, I said at the time, we're going through stuff that none of us had really gone through in an all-black jersey, and it was hard. And... Um, but we just had to own it, and we had to be the people to come up with the solutions. So, we've done some good problem solving. We've, we've worked hard. It's 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 given this team a little bit of steel, um, and and it's given us some some harsh lessons that we kind of wish we didn't have to live with, but we did. And and in those situations, what do you do? You either fold and walk away because it's too hard, or you you buckle up and, and get stuck into work and you know the, the the work of the players you know led by this fella and some of our leaders has been phenomenal and, and we're growing belief but we've still got some steps to go. Do you have an early report on how Bill is doing? No I haven't actually but he seemed pretty jovial in the shed so it, I don't think there's anything significant in the area. Right?